Hello. Hello. Welcome to episode 18, 18 of Curtain Call. We're glad you're here. Just having a quick brew. <laughs> We're a bit, a bit dry. <laughs> and a bit hungry. And a bit hungry, apparently. My little tummy was uh, rumbling. <laughs> now then, we need to talk to you about Facebook's new settings, don't we? Because it's changing. You, some of you probably won't realise. But what we do, like our little adverts for shows and stuff like that that's going on, mm-hmm. they are not going to appear in your timelines anymore. So what you need to do is, when you go on our Facebook page... Yep. On the first page, you'll see a little tab near the sort of top picture that says following. So if you hover over that, it's like a little downward V arrow. And that will bring another drop down menu and it'll say in your news feeds. And you go onto that and then you check the little box that says see first, which means normal service is resumed. You don't get any ads, you don't get anything like that. It's just that you see what you were seeing. A few weeks ago, that's it. But Facebook are doing it to sort of try and get everybody to spend loads of money and we don't want that to happen to you. So if you just do that, follow our little instructions on the front page, there's a little box that says following, hover it, get the downward menu and it'll say in your news feed and just go onto that in your news feed and then see first and just check it and that's it, dead simple. So we've taught you something, haven't we? (laughs) So, what else we're going to talk about is some shows that are on the critical list. Woo! 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 Sally Farsley was all out! Right, Giovanni. Yeah. That's powerful. nearly gone. Yep. That is, I, I think we've only got about six tickets left. Yeah. So, you need to be quick. Uh, Barry Steele, I think there's two, as we speak, I think oh, there's just two. two tickets left. Now then, G4. There are still some seats left, but... They have been in contact with us, and we have got a few more VIP. We've been allowed to oh, yeah. offer a few more VIP tickets. Um, and I've just been speaking to the management, actually, and you, you'll come in earlier, so you'll come in before the show starts, and you'll be taken to a private room, this is the VIP ticket, mm. and you'll be given a glass of bubbles, <laughs> and you'll meet the boys, and you'll have a chat, and have your photos. So it's a really, yeah. and that's before the show. So it's a really nice start. To the night, that really good present, but there isn't tons left. You need to be quick, quick, and I think that'll be really good. And ask class the bubbles with the boys. <laughs> I might uh, join in just to uh, get some photos. You know, you know what I mean. Right, what else have we got? The South, the South. Now, eighties band, really iconic. We've, we've got two really iconic eighties bands. We've got the Christians, yeah, and the South. But I mean, the South. Well, they were beautiful South, weren't they? Yeah. So, and what they sang songs... Don't marry her. Don't marry her, have me. And someday <laughs> sun shines down on San Francisco Bay. <laughs> so, yeah, they sung that one. Well, to them. This could be Rotterdam or anywhere, Liverpool or Rome. Yeah. Perfect ten. Well, that's obviously me. I can't... <laughs> <I'm not. laughs> Perfect ten. Yeah. Because sweet love I love... In different sizes. That one, yeah. Yep. I need a little time. I need a little time to think things over. That's all you got that. Very nice. Right? That very nice. A bit very of nice. yeah. of the morning, you see. <laughs> but really iconic songs, this. And yeah. you did know some of them, didn't you? I actually did know some yes. of them. Yes. So, makes a change. <laughs> that does make a change. So, <laughs> they're for like adults, aren't they? Hmm. And we're going to talk about some kids' shows, aren't we? Yeah, we've got a lot going on for kids. We've got Alice in Wonderland. Yeah, and that's in April, which... The should be Easter it's time. It's Easter time, and yeah. I think it's the 1st of April, a Saturday or a Sunday. Mm, mm, Sunday. Anyway, I think it's a, uh, yeah, some, it's a Sunday. Some schools are, are, um, have got the Easter weekend off, then they go back for a week, and then they're off for two weeks, and some... The Easter weekends in so, the middle, yeah. but these are around the Easter yeah. holidays. And the good times anyway. They are. They don't have Sunday afternoons, spend. you've got a one o'clock showing and a half past four. four, and that's Alice in Wonderland, and that's got, it was Britain's Got Talent winner, wasn't it, uh, Ashley, and Pud- she had a dog, well, Pudsey, and unfortunately yeah. Pudsey's not with us anymore. Um, so so Sully. Sully, uh, Leslie Ash, and this, uh, I can't remember Dave who else. Benson. Dave Benson. We, we've got, it's a good, really good show. Yeah. And I don't know whether you know, but I like a bit of pantomime. So, Rena is trying to get herself another job. <laughs> yeah. And she really, really wants a really small... It's not the role that you get, 
it's what you make of the role. Correct. She Correct. wants a small role. Just a little cameo part walk on. So you might see Raina walk Bit of slap on. my thighs <laughs> and then walk off again. <laughs> so yeah, bit of a pantomime. We like that, bit of Easter pantomime. Yeah. A lot of family fun. Yeah. Um, single on Beauty and the Beast? Single on Beauty and the Beast. I'm really, really looking forward to this. You really I am. I've got my chip backpack really? and um, I've got my chip purse. And I'm ready to come. You got your pennies for an ice cream? I've got my pennies for an ice cream. Well, it's seven o'clock, so it might be Prosecco. Oh, right, okay. So that'll be really good. And I know some people will be coming in fancy dress to that. You included. No, I, I, I'll get my bell dress out. No. But I think because that is a children's show, as well as obviously for young adults like myself, <laughs> um, there will be people coming in fancy dress, so I think we're going to see loads of little girls in yeah, bell dresses, which is yeah. really good. And you get to watch the movie, and we get to sing song, and we'll get a prop bag. Mm-hmm. My God, my Saturday night's made up. <laughs> That's just like my idea of heaven. <laughs> and the next one... Milkshake. Channel 5's Milkshake, Milkshake this magic storybook. Mm-hmm. Um, they're coming, so the, some of the presenters are coming, the characters. Saturday the 12th of May, that's got two showings. That's at noon and at half past three. Now, all these shows are selling. Yeah. I think Milkshake is definitely... Yeah, it's, um, Alice in Wonderland, that has yeah. only just gone on last week, wasn't yeah, it? people have bought People tickets. are buying tickets. Sing Along a Beauty and the Beast, that is selling. So, if you want to bring your kids... Need to be quick. You need to book it. I know we'll like end at month, aren't we? We've, we've had this January's been a long longest month. month. <laughs> you know, we're all recovering from Christmas, but you know, these Things are really good. Uh, get in touch for these uh, kids' shows. Yeah, definitely. Right, we've got a bit of an exclusive. Ooh. <laughs> you spoke, we listened. <laughs> and Laura will say, well, she. <laughs> I didn't speak. She didn't speak. <laughs> Yeah, you spoke and we listened. <laughs> Back by popular demand, yeah. Friday the 19th of October, 7.30. Tell oh. them! The best of the Eagles' greatest hits to uh, 2018. I mean, I know they've been, I think they've come the past couple of years, but they sell out so quickly. You don't know any Eagles songs, do you? <laughs> so there's no point in going on about that. But they're on sale now, so you do need to get in touch. They are selling. We've only had it on a couple of days. They're coming this morning. We've sold some already. So Need be to. quick. It always yeah, sells out. Do not be disappointed. Well, I think that's the we're nearly wrapping up. But I think so. But yeah. how do they get in touch? We'll go through all that. So have a contact us on our website at www.burnmechanics.co.uk. Give us a ring at the box office. Double six double four double zero. If you want to see any of the promos for any of the shows that are coming. Uh, obviously watch any old curtain calls because I know that people do uh, head over to the YouTube channel at the Mechanics Theatre Burnley give us a tweet we like a tweet don't yeah, we yeah we do like a tweet and Instagram now some of our customers have been coming in they've been sat here in the day having a gin and tonic well, and taking a photo and tagging us on Instagram so you can head over to our Instagram page which is Burnley Mechanics, can't you? Yeah. And the most important thing we're going to say to you today is... Don't forget to... to like, like, comment, and share. share. <laughs> and next week, we'll try and get Chef James in because everybody's yeah. been doing dry January and being dating, so we'll try and get him to come in and maybe do us a little treat yeah. next week. A bit of cake nice. or something. That'd be nice. Mm. See if he can whip something up. <laughs> mm. So we hope you have a good rest good of the week. week. Have a safe weekend. Burnley Halfway through, nearly done. Happy hump day. <laughs> Uh, Burnley are at home on Saturday. Playing to, is it Man City? I don't know. It's one of the Manchester ones. I think it's Man City. Come so, in and pop into your radar. Yes, I'll be in the box office Saturday morning. So if anybody wants to call in for tickets or anything, I'll be here yep. with my sparkling personality. <laughs> <laughs> on a Saturday. But yeah. Cross that. Yeah, cross that. But yeah, we'll see you next week. Take yep. care. Bye. See you later. Bye.